Ours may be the first civilization destroyed, not by the power of our enemies, but by the sheer stupidity, ignorance, and snowflakiness of our countrymen. This video is brought to you by the censorship hating crew over at Night Solar. This brand new ultra bright wireless flashlight with motion detectors makes it super easy to light up all the dark spots in your yard. You can install it anywhere because it's wireless and you never need to worry about buying batteries for it because it's solar powered with a high powered battery storage pack and freaking bright LED lights. Don't spend hundreds of dollars on floodlights. Go to nightsolar.com and get 52% off with free shipping. The link's in the description. The insanity and instability in the people in this world has reached such a fever pitch and it's coming in so fast now, it's really hard to keep up. It seems that life's jokes continue to write themselves. People are frothing at the mouth so bad to cancel their surrounding culture to make themselves feel better in their virtue signaling habitats that it overlaps and swings back around as spineless morons are starting to cancel even themselves. In the latest round of nincompoopery, news outlets are reporting a victory for um, a victory for something. So you can rest easy. Everything's all better now. Whatever was wrong with the world has been at least made partially right because of the Dixie Chicks' brave and beautiful decision. The Daily Caller reports, the Dixie Chicks have changed name to exclude the word Dixie amid heightened discussions of racism. Now, I know all my black brothers will sleep easier tonight knowing that a major wrong in this world was righted. The Daily Caller says, the Dixie Chicks have dropped the word Dixie from their band name following an increase in discussions regarding racism. The band will now be named The Chicks, and the social media pages reflect the change, according to a report published Thursday by Pitchfork. Now, you gotta applaud the chips for dipping their toes in the water on this one, but really, that's all they did. Because, you see... They've kept a word that people constantly use to objectify women. And in this Me Too era, well, that just can't be tolerated. They need to drop the sexist terminology and just stick with the word the. Although that's problematic too because the is a definite article. And in our new world where there are no definites in the land of inclusion and love, well, we have to go with an indefinite article. How about Anne? Yeah, let's just call him Anne. If that doesn't work, I suggest that this image be strongly considered for their next album cover and just modify the word chicks with the adjective spineless. Thus, the new band name can be the spineless chickens. But then we don't want to offend the animal rights crew, so I guess we're back to square one. Maybe they can just stop singing and drop out of the entertainment industry altogether. Unlike Lady Antebellum, the Dixie Chicks seemingly reached out to another group that already went by the name The Chicks before making the change across their platforms. The band said in a statement to Pitchfork, a sincere and heartfelt thank you goes out to the Chicks of New Zealand for their gracious gesture and allowing us to share their name. We are honored to coexist together in a world with these exceptionally talented sisters. Chicks rock. I don't know, that sounds a little sexist to me. Even the marketing materials for their new song, March March, reflect this new name. The name change comes after Variety published an op-ed entitled, After Lady A, is it time for the Dixie Chicks to rethink their name? Because, you know, the snowflakes of this world rest their souls on the names of bands. That's how bad it's gotten. You know people can't sleep or eat unless statues come down and monuments are demolished. You know things won't be right with the world until businesses are looted, trashed and burned, till cars are flipped over in the streets. As a matter of fact, if certain people don't get exactly what they want, in the words of the leaders of the Black Lives Matter movement, they will burn this system to the ground. I, I didn't you say wanna, it's, it's, you it's, it's burn time. It down. I said if this country, if this country doesn't give us what we want, then we will burn down this system and replace it. 
all right? And I could be speaking phys phy uh, figuratively. Okay. I could be speaking literally. It's a matter of interpretation. Like, let's be very real. And, and, and let's observe the history of the 1960s. We stand at a critical point in history. Give black people their rights, or we will burn this country to ashes. And of course, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube are perfectly fine with this because we know if they weren't, they would terminate these people's accounts. And just as a reminder, People like this are who the Dixie Chicks are placating to. You never want to bow down to the violent outrage mob. Maybe we should just get it over with now and cancel Earth because it's been proven to have contained racism. Leave your thoughts about this for the world, the Google Thought Police, and the unstable outrage mob in the comments section below. I mean, I'm glad there was not a right-wing takeover, but we end up with a Republican... A Rockefeller Republican in blackface with uh, Barack Obama. So that our struggle in regard to poverty intensifies. That's a pretty rough assessment of President Obama. Oh, that's what we have. That's what we have. Richard Nixon is to the left of him on health care. Richard Nixon is to the left of him on guaranteed income. And the same policies in terms of imperial foreign policy is at work. If you get something out of this content and you want to support this channel, one of the best ways you can do that is by liking this video and sharing it with everybody you can, everywhere you can on social media. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification icon so that whenever I upload a video, you're one of the first to see it. If you want to further support the channel, the Patreon, PayPal, Bitcoin, and Subscribestar links are in the description below and in the pinned comment. Or you can grab one of these conversation starting, hard hitting designs that you can put on any shirt, hoodie, or mug from the shirt store. And that link is also in the description. Your purchase helps support more content on this channel. I will see you guys in the next heavily censored, shadow banned, and now 100% demonetized video.